birthday, grade 4 little scientist. I'm Teacher V, your scientific buddy. Are you ready to learn? Let's go! For this week's lesson, quarter 1, week 4, describe changes in properties of materials when exposed to certain conditions such as temperature or when mixed with other materials. Part 1. Before we proceed with our lesson, let's have a short recap of our lesson last week. Looking back. Identify how the following materials were changed. Take a look at this video. How were the materials changed? Very good! By cutting! Take a look at this video clip. How was the material changed? You got it right! By bending! Take a look at this video clip. How was the material changed? Good job! By pressing! Take a look at this material. How was the material changed? Very good! By hammering! Now, let's learn together! Describe changes in properties of materials when exposed to different temperatures. Temperature. It is the hotness or coldness of an object. Thermometer. It is a device used for measuring temperature. Heating. Increasing temperature. It may change solid to liquid, liquid to gas, or solid to gas. Cooling, decreasing temperature. It may change liquid to solid or gas to liquid. Remember, changes in temperature can cause a physical change and no new material will be formed. Evaporation, condensation, melting, Freezing and sublimation are the changes in temperature that causes physical change. Evaporation turns liquid to gas. This happens when a liquid material absorbs heat energy and turns to gas. Examples are boiling water and drying clothes. Condensation turns gas to liquid. This happens when gas loses heat and turns to liquid. Examples are cold drinks, drinks with ice cubes. Melting turns solid to liquid. This happens when a solid material absorbs heat energy and turns to liquid. Examples are melting ice, melting butter, and melting ice cream. Freezing turns liquid to solid. This happens when heat is removed. Examples are ice and ice cream. Sublimation turns solid to gas. This happens when a solid material absorbs heat energy and turns to gas. Examples are dry ice and naphthalene rolls. Remember, the increase or decrease of temperature may change materials from one form to another. Only the physical appearance may change. Now, let's try to answer these questions.
Are you ready? All of the following are ways of changing materials by changing their temperature, except one. What is it? A. Freezing B. Evaporation C. Melting D. Mixing The correct answer is D. Mixing What phase change may take place with the dry ice as the temperature increases? A. Liquid to gas B. Liquid to solid C. Solid to gas D. Solid to liquid The correct answer is C. Solid to gas for a material to undergo condensation, what should happen to the temperature? A. Decreases B. Increases C. No change D. All of them is correct. The correct answer is A. Decreases Nico heated the chocolate bar to make chocolate syrup. Which of the following best describes what changes happen to the chocolate bar when heated? The chocolate bar change its A. Size and shape B. Taste and odor C. Texture and odor D. Odor and texture The correct answer is A. Size and shape What will you do to dissolve sugar faster in a cup without stirring? A. Add hot water B. Add cold water C. Add more water to the sugar D. Add more sugar to the water Correct answer is A. Add hot water. Remember, visit our Facebook group at 1 p.m. for your formative task and visit our Google Classroom tomorrow and Friday for your worksheet and quiz for this week. Congratulations! We're done with our lesson today. See you next video!